Hey, and welcome back to 16 Years of Now Kim Free. You find me in the beautiful place of Broxton. Broxton. B R A N X T O N. Uh, it's just by the Scottish border, uh, which is near a town called Coldstream. You know, home of the Coldstream Guard. Which brings me on to a note. Um, I've been humbled. I love being humbled. Any of you guys that think, or any people out there that think being humble means that you're being brought down, no. It's, you, you know, what you experience being brought up. And I love that. All along this journey, to be humble is, means that the experience that I thought I was going to have, or I did have, has been exploded into something so much better. And last night, I got humbled. And thank you, Mark, Mark. And Sebastian, your wives, everybody, thank you so much. Um, you've seen my video before. We're not even going to go into that. That's where it is in the past. Uh, but these guys, oh, my God. Mark John Marshall. Yeah. You know, when they say a brother from a different mother, he is he is that. He, he you know, he just brought me into his group of friends. You know, just by, he came over and he offered me, he said, oh, do you want some sausages? I'm cooking some sausages. Oh, you know what then, mate? I'll, I'll come over and have some sausages with you. You know, he sat there and had some of these sausages. That was so nice. You have to tell me where you get them from, John. Uh, Mark, sorry. <laughs> I'm terrible with names. And then, yeah. Uh, and then I, I was talking to him. And, uh, you, you know, he taught me so much about Middlesbrough being called Smoggies. Uh, I'm not going to say what you said about Hartley Paul because otherwise I end up in the news myself um, but yeah such beautiful beautiful people um, yeah I, I spent the entire afternoon evening with them uh, you know they gave me food beautifully cooked chicken even though that was <laughs> an accident but oh my word that it, that was just so beautiful and the people that I met were so beautiful as well they just taught me more and more and just showed me more and more and more love uh, for the places that I've been through that, you know, as I said, that's in the video before. But yeah, they are brilliant people and the experiences that they gave me last night were just tremendous. They just out of this world and my heart, my love to all of you is there. You know it is and it, it, the presents that I got given from John, I always wanted to do a walking pole, and he gave me a walking pole. It was solid wood, nice notched handle, solid bottom, and here I have it. Just a gift, you know, of love and understanding and what people go through. And then Sebastian gave me a gift as well. Oh, no, uh, where is it? Check that out. In with the root, reindeer antler. You know, this, um, by the way, Sebastian, uh, it sleeps, it, it sleeps with me, it goes in my pillowcase, because I feel the luck and the magic that it brings is just, you know, and the same as this. You know, this is right next to me. I didn't take it walking today, um, because, uh, on the Holy Island. Uh, one, because, I must admit, I completely forgot, and two, I felt a little bit fragile. Uh, yeah, they did ply me with some, uh, you know what it goes like. But I, I really cannot say enough of how to be changed of an opinion of what you went through to what you, it becomes. And that's why I love being humbled. I love it. Absolutely love being humbled. I love being proved wrong. I love being, you know, shown a different way. Uh, and the only reason that I found uh, Holy Island or knew of Holy Island is because of you guys. You know, um, you know, Mark John Marshall, and his wife, you know, and everybody like that. You know, they taught me so much about the North East and showed me a proper greeting. You know, you saw that photo, the photo of all, all of us there. Just if there's ever love and understanding and friendship coming bonding together, that photo just absolutely, absolutely shows it. I, I just, ah. Oh. I'm still meant to be doing, you know, my thoughts of Yorkshire. And, you know, that's completely gone out the window. I'm, I know I've got to do it, and I will do. Um, I'm here, you know, where I am now. I'm thinking of, well, between here, 
you know, I did say I weren't going to pop into Scotland, but it's only just up the road, so I quickly popped into Scotland. But yeah, wow. Just wow. You know, to be humbled like that. And as I said, my heart, my love goes out for all of you that I met last night and yesterday afternoon. It really does. And I so, so appreciate meeting you. It's made this trip, you know, excuse me, you know, I've met other people and everything like that. But yeah, you know, you're up there, you know, the guys in the Peak District and I've got you guys in, uh, in the North East. Yeah, as you said in your uh, photo earlier, friends for life. And on that note, as I always say, guys, take it easy, keep adventuring, and love you, bye.